I have BB Pro Emily Hayden. Hey guys, what's going on there? I'm just just back now from my West Coast trip. It's Tuesday uh, afternoon, and uh, what an amazing time I had just uh, seeing some new friends, some old friends, and uh, being a part of a fitness community that really, it just seems to be in such good hands right now. I really enjoy the people we got to see. The clip you just watched was, um, the first day that Lauren and I arrived in Los Angeles, we immediately got our rental car and headed straight to Barbell Brigade. And a special thanks to my friend Sarah Park, who I met at the uh, at the Arnold this year, and we just kept in touch. And you know, he's hooked me up with some clothing, and I sent him some clothing. And so we've just kind of uh, created a friendship, and it was really great to go spend an afternoon with him, lift at the awesome Barbell Brigade, which. It's kind of become iconic, you know, seeing it through people's channels, all the great people that train there, and uh, it did not disappoint. Beautiful gym in downtown Los Angeles. So those are just some of the highlights from that day. And then Sarah was also nice enough to take us to Waba Grill, which was my first time experiencing uh, that, and uh, really enjoyed that as well. So the rest of the video is just going to be some clips. Um, I tried to get as much footage as I could. Uh, Lauren Conlon, who's on the trip with me, who also has a YouTube channel, so you can go check out the footage on her channel um, of what she got from the trip, is in contest prep. So it was important to me that we, you know, kind of try to fit in all the things we wanted to do as well as keep up with her, you know, process of dieting. So I uh, volunteered to do a bunch of cardio with her. We went on some hikes. Um, you'll see in Vegas, we took some long walks. We did some rock climbing. You know, we kind of kept it interesting to go along with. The, uh, the amazing times we had, we stayed with uh, some of my friends in Redondo Beach, which was amazing. We got to visit Quest Headquarters, which I didn't film that part, um, just out of respect for what, for what they're doing at Quest. But, you know, uh, Josh and Victoria opened their home to me and Lauren, and then uh, we picked up Emily Hayden's husband on Thursday and drove to Las Vegas, and uh, then I had three clients competing. Lauren had a couple clients competing. Overall, just a fantastic weekend so hope you enjoy the footage and um yeah you know i don't get to uh put together these type of videos very often but whenever i travel i sure love to get as many clips as i can and hopefully you guys enjoy it and uh all right enjoy just hiked from down there and that is downtown los angeles Together
House restaurant by Gold's Gym, and we're, uh, I got a buffalo bowl. I'm a razor, right? Brandon told me it was the oh, best. Okay. I like to go there. So far, so good. <laughs> You're all right for now. <laughs> what is happening, y'all? It's Paul coming to you live from Redondo Beach. So thank you, Josh and Victoria. Uh, really great crib. Enjoying your hammock. They both work for Quest Nutrition. Amazing company. Got to tour the facility today after training at Gold Gym in Venice Beach and eating at Firehouse. Just had a... Uh, fantastic day all around and uh, it's not done yet we're gonna do some sightseeing and exploring in Redondo tonight we got to pose with uh, Emily Hayden today Amanda Bucci posed with us as well both girls you know look fantastic so weather's amazing people are awesome you know maybe I'm biased because the people I see here comes our little puppy dog we got two Pomeranians ridiculous when you're from Florida how nice the weather is out here Dondo Beach, 7.30 a.m. Good morning. Josh and Victoria. Do you like my morning hair? <laughs> Welcome to Redondo. How do we get down there? Oh, Here's the awesomeness. Stairs are this way. Stairs are right uh -huh. here. Oh, right here. Just kidding. Just kidding. <laughs> here they this are. Is Snapchat or something. <laughs> it's the YouTubes. <laughs> My voice is effed, and uh, Lauren has doped me into doing cardio once again. This vlog is going to be all about cardio. And now we are down here on the strip. We're going to do an hour walk. Uh, yeah, we got the Fitbit going, but it's pretty cool because we got the uh, the backdrop of Las Vegas, which is you know different than where we live. So. Anyway, guys, I'll shoot some footage of where we're going. Any cool things we're going to see, I don't know. All right, y'all. Part of our walk, we are stopping here to walk through the lobby at the Bellagio. If you've never done that, they always have some crazy stuff going on. And this here is no different. It's like an underwater scene. Sea life. All right, next point of interest, the, the bridge at Aria. You can see the whole strip from here. Sorry if I'm making you all dizzy, but we're trying to keep a good pace. So anyway, trying to shoot some interesting things. Vegas is just fucking awesome. There's so much cool stuff here. And uh, trying to shoot a little bit of it, so. Anyway, Cosmopolitan Aria Bridge. Um, live music. Another point of interest here at the Aria Hotel are these cool ass tornado fountains and if you don't even notice, they're all uh, different sizes and shapes and then some of them are actually below. No, it's YouTube Inception when you do this. Are you Snapchatting? You'll see the lighting was like a little funky. What's up, y'all? So this is uh, Friday night after USA's went back, changed eight. Lauren and I came and found a City Athletic Club. Never trained here before. Very uh, different atmosphere, very dark, and 
and uh, like a nightclub almost in here. Lauren's over there somewhere trying to get a good selfie. Yup, there she is. And uh, I mean, it's really dark in here. But some IFBB pros in here. Sean Roden's over there training. Everybody in here is jacked and tan. So it's a good, good club, lots of good equipment. Just a very different environment, almost like a nightclub. Loud music, dark. Check it out if you're in Vegas. All right. All right, we're surviving. After dinner, ooh, I was a little beat up. I think we we're dehydrated. I had like six glasses of water. These girls don't have any clothes on. Not sure I want that in my video. This is a family channel, so I'm not gonna show you that. Ready, split second. No clothes on. Those were actually painted on bathing suits. This is the strip at night. Me and Lauren are getting in some cardio because we haven't walked enough today. Bellagio behind us, uh, Planet Hollywood in front of us. Well, well, we just had our first ever meal at the Protein House here in Las Vegas, owned by Larissa Reese, and so we're gonna make Lauren start a food vlog. So if anybody's interested in watching a food vlog on Lauren's channel, <laughs> comment below, because I think she'd be really good at it. So what is your feedback on the food at Protein House? Food was amazing, uh, really good options. Uh, it's known as a fit food and espresso restaurant, which is exactly what you'd think it would be, but it all tastes really good. I got, um, they had a lot of bowls, so I got ground bison um, with half rice, half quinoa, and lots of veggies and a little bit of avocado. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> and then you got seared, a weird combination, but seared yeah. ahi with a pineapple slice, a tomato slice, egg whites, and then like a chili sauce with an Ezekiel English muffin. And a couple mushrooms. And some mushrooms. It was called a ninja burger. So I really, because of the tuna, maybe it had like an Asian, but it wasn't teriyaki. So I don't yeah. know. Whatever. It's called a ninja burger, but it was really, it was really different. Awesome. And they have breakfast options, protein pancake yeah. options, smoothies. We the also menu's got... actually really big. Like it yeah. took us a few minutes to pick something yeah. out. Um, they had the yogurt wasn't working. We were going to try the yogurt, the protein yogurt. They have that would have been awesome. But they had like bars and cookies in there. Yeah, like it was really clean stuff. and everything looked fresh. I mean, obviously yeah. the uh, the. I wouldn't eat seared ahi tuna if I didn't think it was fresh, but it looked, all the food was yeah, presented no. really nice, the bowls. Yeah, it was definitely worth it, and um, it, Yeah, it wasn't it just like a here. protein franchise, it was like a no, nice it wasn't. restaurant. Yeah, it was actually like a good... Yeah, like, um, if this was a chain in Florida, we'd definitely frequent it. Oh, yeah. Want to yeah. want to start a franchise? <laughs> I don't like managing people, so no. I'll eat there if you open one near me. In Florida. So... That's it. This is the introduction to Lauren Conlon, the the vulgar vlog, the vulgar foodie. Now we're gonna go to Red Rocks. Yeah, we're gonna go, we'll drive out to Red Rock, hike. It's really dusty today, so I'm hoping it's not. Whatever. I don't know what that means. Maybe it's dusty out there too. Anywho, don't look at me like that. Uh, it is 11:15 a.m. Time to go hike in the desert. This is our video at the top of the hill.
Finishing in second place, number three, 29, Emily Hendon. BB Pro Emily Hayden. I just tried to say that for my YouTube channel and I couldn't even spit it out. I was like, I just became an IP. What do you got to say to uh, the rest of the girls on Team Pro Physique that wanna? Never give up. When you don't get the placing that you want, just know that it happens for a reason and it's just gonna make you a better competitor. It's gonna make you stronger. And you can have confidence in Paul and know that he knows what he's talking about. You never have to question anything, which is something that I really appreciate. And overall, just go out there and do what you love. If you love it, keep doing it. Keep showing up and it'll happen. I just trying to get a video so it's, you can see how big they are next to you, like scale. Yeah. Well, probably strange to say, but this might be the weirdest thing in Vegas. <laughs> Well, this is the last thing we're doing before we head to the airport, before we eat on our way to the airport anyway. And uh, this is some giant artwork in the middle of the desert called Seven Magic Mountains. And uh, it's completely pointless, I think, uh, but it's an interesting thing to look at. It's really windy out here and dusty, so I'm trying to get some so you guys can see the perspective of these things. I'd say they're 40, maybe a little bit taller. Some of them are just randomly colors. Anyway, that's the end of this trip. About to get on the airplane, head home, see my family. Very excited, an amazing, successful trip. And uh, I hope you guys have enjoyed some of the footage. We tried to, uh, you know, even though it was work, try to make the most of it. Lauren's never been out to the West Coast before, uh, at least to California, and never done all this touristy crap in Vegas, which, shoot, I haven't even done. So it's been kind of fun to, like, explore. So, anyway, guys, Seven Magic Mountains.